Well, it wasn't a very nice time for women. Uh, and so I think that's why a lot of us went looking in our songs for symbols and, and, and actually extraordinary women. There were many extraordinary women. That's what's so um, kind of, uh, why it has such a, a duality and such a complexity, that period. There were female poets and this incredible queen character. And there was also uh, Grace O'Malley, the pirate queen. Irish pirate queen and there's in fact there's a whole symphony about her we thought we'd add to it a tiny little bit um, and this is a song uh, called Broadside and I guess it's kind of a feminist shanty if there is such a thing there is now I should say that um, I, I came I came to this gig um, having not encountered Nancy yet, but I've, I've certainly been a, a long time admirer of Martin so I, I went up to Martin and uh, had this kind of cocky guitar riff, you know, I thought, right, I'll kind of show him what I'm made of. So I played him this thing that, I said, what do you think of that? So he played something back at me that tore me in half. And then, <laughs> so between us, we kind of put a time on it and we, we kind of found a bit of a groove and we brought it to Nancy. And I said, Nancy, you know, it'd be good to put a shanty over this. And she went, oh, right, okay. So Martin and I stood there sweating, trying to play this riff while Nancy got off for about, I don't know, 10 minutes. And then came back with this song that you're about to hear. <laughs> Yeah, she went off and had a cup of peppermint tea and then <laughs> came back with this. That's what you're about to it's say. mead. <laughs> of England, France and Spain for there's nothing like dominion of the water from the rocky coast of Kerry to the bloody Spanish main it's the best thing you can ever teach a daughter broadside to broadside two captains collide queen of the seas and queen of the tide regalia and rebellion go sailing side by side haul away sister haul away there was one particular piece that we put together John Smith and, and Nancy Kerr and I yesterday, which required basically playing it for about two and a half hours non-stop. And that's <laughs> really hard on the fingers and really hard on the concentration, you know. So at the end of it, you're dish rag, basically. And I'm not complaining. It's, fanta it's fantastic. Be generous to friendship and lavish to your foes. Then pirate queens may sail the seas in common. Broadside to broadside, two captains collide. Queen of the spheres and queen of the tide. Regalia and rebellion are sailing side by side. All the way, sister, all the way. Nancy, Rachel, Elizabeth, and Hannah were all new, new to me, and I'm just blown away and quite annoyed with myself for not discovering them before now. Um, it's lovely just yeah, working with new people, it's, it's a luxury. Weary and marriage make a slave, you do better on the sea like Brave Oak Valley. And when that gallant vessel goes a rolling on the wave, be sure you're on the deck, not in the galley. Broadside to broadside, two captains collide. Queen of the spheres is queen of the tide. Regalia and rebellion are... But it is very, very draining indeed, and very emotionally draining when you're writing about you know, death warrants and extreme violence <laughs> which you know the Elizabethan period was full of that kind of thing Nancy Kerr, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs>